Yo, what is up guys? Uh, it's me, Jules, and I'm back once again. And today, I'm going to show you a very special food that I have found in Japan. And it is this one today. This is called natto, uh, fermented uh, fermented soybeans. And uh, since this is fermented, then it, this is actually good for your stomach. So if you are constipated like me, then you should try this one. So, um, without further ado, let's start. Um, so, I have partially opened this one. And, oh, by the way, uh, this one comes in uh, three packets. So, maybe maybe this food is actually that good because, you know, if you can't, if you're not satisfied with the one, with the one packet, then you can still have second and third round. So, yeah, though actually this is not really recommended by my friend. I don't know what this one is, but this one looks a uh, Japanese soy sauce. It has um, it has the the instruction. Anyways, so there's an instruction though I can read them. Uh, so yeah, let's open this one and do 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 do. Wait, oh. oh wow so slimy I don't know if you can see it but what what hmm The smell is like the smell is not that bad actually. It smells like it smells salty. In Tagalog, it's maalat. So if you can see this one, but but. Um, you should um, mix this mix this uh, for one minute so yeah so let's do this now I'm gonna start my timer so I'm gonna start I'm gonna start my timer and uh, for one minute So you should stir this in one direction for uh, continuously for one minute. Um, should I try this now? Well, later. Okay, let's go. Ew, ew, this looks so <laughs> yucky. <laughs> Yuck. Looks like spider web. Twenty six seconds remaining, and we are done. <laughs> Doesn't really look good. <laughs> Okay, we're done. So this is Hey focus man, focus. Yo, 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 yo. Ah! 
doesn't really look appealing but as you can see oi oi focus yo yay it is focusing so yeah, this is the nut Whoa. So, I'm going to try this without mixing these first because that's how I wanted to try food for the first time. No. Oh, should I? Should I try this one? Because actually, my friend hates this. My friend really hates this one, and it's like the most disgusting food that she has ever tasted. Itadakimas. Mm. It's not really bad. It's seriously, it's not really bad. I just hate the slimy thing. But it's actually really good. I mean, not really good, but but there's no reason for me to hate this food. Like seriously, sorry, friend. Sorry, my friend. If you're watching this, I'm really sorry because I don't hate this food as much as you do. <laughs> Anyways, um, so yeah. Um, my friend says that also that this food uh usually eaten with rice, so I have my rice with me. Oh, wait, before that, I'm going to mix this one. Maybe it will help me. I mean, it will help this one make. I uh, <laughs> my English is like. Maybe this will help. Uh, become more delicious or. <laughs> Anyway, so yes, I'm going to. Sorry, I don't have a table, but let's see what's this one. Ah. Um. This is this yellow thing. I'm gonna. I'm gonna put this one. Oh, wait, let me try this one first before I. Ah, soy sauce. I'm gonna put this one. So, yeah, I have poured the soy sauce and let's mix this again once again. Mmm, -hmm, yummers! So much bubbles and yay, slime, slime. Psh, psh. Mm. Itadakimas. This natto tastes better with soy sauce, so I recommend putting. I recommend you to put soy sauce, but I don't really recommend to put the yellow one, the mustard one, because it's spicy. So yeah, I can finish this one. Ah, <laughs> eh. I'm gonna put the. I mean, since I'm not chopping, I'm gonna use my spoon. Actually, I have my rice with me. So, let's eat this. It's really good. I'm gonna eat this with rice.
Maybe because I'm used to eating kimchi. And kimchi... Um, kimchi has like... A very strong smell and taste. Maybe that's why I also like this one because I'm used to the smell and taste of kimchi. Though their, their tastes are different but you know they're both fermented so I'm kind of used to eat fermented ones I mean fermented food so yeah <coughs> I'm actually disappointed because I thought that I would hate this food because my friend was like, you'll never miss something in your life if you don't eat natto. And, you know, it's really good. You know. I recommend this. I, mer uh, I mean, I recommend you to eat this one when you're in Japan because, you know, when you think of, when you think of the, uh, Japanese food, um, normally people would say um, ramen, sushi, well, matcha. Matcha is good, you know. You'll never go wrong with matcha. So yeah, um, I also recommend you to eat this one, and it's really cheap. It's only like um, less than a hundred yen. I bought this in a convenience store. It, it only costs like seventy six yen. So I uh, I think this is the small one. I mean, wait, oh, there's an expiration date and. There's an expiration date and today is December 11 and the expiration date is December 9. Um, okay, so I just ate an expired natto. I mean, I mean, it's already fermented, no? So, will I die? <laughs> you know, I get diarrhea because I ate an expired natto. Mm, anyways, anyways. Oh well, I'm just gonna eat this one because there's no mold yet. So I hope it's still good to eat. So yeah, I recommend you. Hmm. Oh wait, how this? It's really good, the water one. <coughs> I'm so worried because I ate an expired one. Anyway, so yeah, that it's really cheap and I recommend you to eat this maybe the last day of your trip whenever you don't have money left in your wallet or if you don't have enough yen then you can eat this as your lunch with rice and actually I have seen on the internet that you could also eat this with pasta. Yeah, so it's good. Really good. It's really good. I'm not kidding, it's good. It's not the food that you will hate. If you're used to eating kimchi. So yeah, thank you for watching and the next time you go to the the, the next time you go to Japan, you should try this one because it's good. Itadakimasu!